Okay, one minute and counting. Forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. That's part of the Lord's Prayer, isn't it? And it's a part of the Lord's Prayer that was very, very real before the Lord's Prayer was even taught by Jesus to a man who lived many years before King David. This is what he said in Psalm 32. I acknowledged my sin to you and did not cover up my iniquity. I said, I will confess my transgressions to the Lord. And you forgave the guilt of my sin. And who of us is there who is without sin? What a privilege it is that the Lord invites us to confess our sin to him. To say, Lord, here's what I've done and I'm ashamed of it and you shouldn't ever love me again. And then to find out that the Lord is excited to forgive our sin. Like he commanded us to pray, forgive us our sins. He commanded that. And if God commands me to pray that, what does that mean? It means that God wants me to have that. The sending away of all of my guilt so that I can be at peace and yes, face death, even death, unafraid. That makes me ready for anything. It's time. We'll see you next time.